Steve Hewis. Welcome to another game of Schism Pro Gamer. Today we're doing Monkey Business, which is today's daily challenge from Loom Style Defense 5. And we have quite a bit of reading to do before starting this challenge. There are all kinds of limitations and I hate those limitations. Well, um, not so much that there are limitations, but when they make it so like, yeah, you can only go 0, 4, and 4 and 0 on this tower, and 4 and 0 on this tower, and then 2 and 3 on this tower, and uh, yeah, whatever. Yeah, it, uh, it doesn't really amuse me at all. Um, I like it when they say, like, only monkeys can be used, or... Um, I don't know, uh, only uh, mechanical stuff can be used, or only explosive stuff can be used. Because that actually makes sense to me. Anyhow, um, going into this challenge, because that was all about nothing, we are starting off with uh, 203. Uh, uh, yeah, dark monkeys, they're just dark monkeys. And a cannon at, I believe, 2 and 0, 1 and 0. Okay, it's only 1 and 0. Uh, and that continues on to be this, uh, three, three of the zero three and then a two and zero cannon. And some snipers, the snipers are one and two. So they do have camo detection. Uh, I didn't have camo detection for round 24, so I lost some lives there. But I will lose plenty of other lives, so pff, it's not really a problem. I'm going for an early village here. Maybe a little bit too early because obviously it's a big investment. But it will pay itself back eventually, um, yeah, because, well, you get 10% off of every tower that you build in the region, as well as every upgrade that you build in the region. And um, yeah, that is pretty easy to get back. But anyhow, um, what we're doing here is we are just uh, placing everything close to the village, but also close to the entrance, because uh, you want to shoot at the entrance and then when things come back around, you want to shoot at them again. And that is kind of the trick of clock. But yeah, most of you will know that. Uh, anyhow, two cannons now at three and zero, I believe. Yeah, three and zero it is. Um, and then, well, we have uh, plenty of snipers already. But as you can see, the snipers are uh, the only thing that has camo detection. And yeah, round 42 has a lot of camo in it. So I kind of screwed up there. Should have upgraded the village instead. And that way my cannons would have been able to see that um, that wave of camel balloons. So I'm doing that, well, afterwards, which is not very useful, but at least it gets me to not forget that. So uh, we're upgrading all of the snipers now to um, uh, two and three. And yeah, because I don't really need them until round, I don't know, 50. Uh, uh, it's it's not really too much of a problem. Obviously, it's uh, it's better to have that camo detection earlier, and yeah, you should really do that because I lost quite a few lives there. <laughs> Anyhow, um, here the cannons are being upgraded to zero four, and the snipers are still busy uh, upgrading to two and three. Kind of mixing that up a little bit. Obviously, you want that uh, zero four cannon. Because, or sorry, four and zero cannon. Because you um, you want that stun, and you can get either the stun or the upgrade on the ice tower. And yeah, the upgrade on the ice tower is just too expensive for now. Uh, we're we're doing that right now. I mean, we're saving up for it right now. There you go. Finally getting that, and that means that uh, all of the small balloons are no longer a problem. So you can now focus on getting rid of those moabs and popping them into smaller balloons, because the smaller balloons are no longer well any issue uh, once you have that ice tower with something to uh, to help out with the popping. Uh, in this case, it's a cannon set to first at a z zero four, no four and zero. Wow, why do I keep doing that? At four and zero. Uh, so the left cannon is set to first, the other one is set to strong. Uh, obviously, cannon set to strong will shoot at the entrance more than cannon set to first, but, well, you get the point. Anyhow, uh, the BFB then, yeah, because I have five sniper monkeys uh, at full upgrades, so two and three. Uh, yeah, that is uh, quite an easy one. You can, of course, go for one of the sniper monkeys at three and two, but it's really not useful. As you can see, it easily cleans up and the three and zero or four, four and zero becomes that. Uh, the four and zero uh, sniper monkey is really expensive, so you really don't want that. 
Um, yeah, round 63, we have three cannons at four and zero, so yeah, no problem at all. All in all, it took me two times to actually complete because I wasn't sure what to do the first time, because I wasn't sure what could be upgraded to what level. But the, well, the secret's all in the village, I guess. Anyway, hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. GG.